Hi, Chris at VR Flight Sim here. There's a problem in the Vulcan Beta where unless you have your graphics settings extremely high, you just get low resolution shadow rendering in the cockpit. There's a setting that you can change to make it so that you have high resolution shadows, whatever your outside detail settings. And I'm gonna show you how to do that. So if we just go to Explorer, and if you can go to your X-Plane 11 resources folder, so X-Plane 11 resources, and there's a file here called settings.txt. Now Lamina Research quite rightly don't want people fiddling directly with this. And in the past, we used to use Fly with Lua scripts to change certain data references so we didn't have to, but those are now locked. So we actually have to change settings within settings.txt. Before you do, and I cannot emphasize this enough, please make a backup of this file. So right click on it, press copy, and then paste, and it will come up with settings copy.txt. And I'm just going to move that out into a backup folder. I did that earlier, as you can see. OK, so back to X-Plane 11, resources, and settings.txt. Now, if you open this file, and I want you to just press Control and F, and look for FBO forward slash shadow cam size. FBO forward slash shadow cam size and click find next and it will take you down to the first instance of that data reference. Now what this is, you know there's that draw shadows on scenery checkbox. What this is saying is according to whether that's ticked or not and according to the level of detail that you have in your other settings, what resolution shall the cockpit shadows be rendered at? And we're going to change all of these to 8192. If your machine struggles with that, you could change them all to 4096, but I think 8192 looks best, and it's what I had on the previous version of X-Plane. So FPO shadow cam size 1024, we're going to change that to 8192. And we're going to do that with all of these shadow cam size settings. And for speed, you could copy 8192 and then just paste over the top of each of these each of these remember we've taken a backup oops we've taken a backup so we're quite happy that if this doesn't work for us we can uh, set it back to normal okay let's close that and press save right so now when you open xplane next time even at low resolutions you'll have at low detail settings sorry you will have high resolution cockpit shadows okay so what we've done is essentially told settings.txt we always want eight megabyte shadows in the cockpit at whatever setting we're running i hope that really helps someone please remember to take a backup don't do this without doing so if anyone gets any trouble just let me know for those of you that are running high resolution, um, high detail settings anyway in your graphics settings, you won't notice any difference because it uses 4096 resolution when you've got all those sliders maxed out. But for those of us with more modest PCs, I really hope this helps and you get your cockpit shadows as nature intended. Okay, take care everyone. Bye.